Hey there folks, welcome to this video and here I'm talking about some news in the world of WRC, that is that Ole Christian Vaby has been confirmed to be entering the 2C competition Hyundai i20 World Rally Car for Rally Monza. And well, firstly well done to Ole Christian for getting that. Um, he's been really good over the past few years in the WRC, I believe his first starts were about 5 or so years ago, at least the first ones that I properly recognised. But this is going to be his first time in a top level World Rally Car in a competitive rally. And I think he's got what it takes to actually put a decent result out as well in that car. Of course, like I said, Pierre Lube has been driving this car over the course of the season. I don't believe that Lube will be entered for Rally Monza, but we haven't seen any kind of official entry as of yet. And with rumours that there might be more guest drivers as well, I wouldn't be surprised if there were more than four Hyundais at Rally Monza. There are also rumours that Andreas Mikkelsen might show up in the uh, Santaloc C3, the one that's been used for the Pirelli tests but uh, with the upgrades, the upgrades that we were expected to see on the Citroen for the 2020 WRC season. However, this is actually something that I'm really looking forward to. Um, like, it's brilliant to see these young drivers coming up, and I don't know if they're going to be evaluated for places next season, but I'd hope that if they're not going to be evaluated for places next season in the main squad, it might mean that Hyundai are looking at bringing a B team for 2021. And I, I know I've been talking about this a lot. If you're following this channel for quite a while, you'll notice I constantly talk about the idea that WRC needs B teams. But, well, I would really want there to be privateer entries. I'd really want there to be the ability for private teams to go, OK, I'm going to buy this car off the shelf. I'm going to enter a driver in it. It's something that we were able to see about 20 years ago in the WRC, which is, funnily enough, when I started watching not long after I was born. We don't really see that in WRC nowadays, that's because the cars are so expensive, and I mean, Oitanak has been talking about a reset of regulation, which I might say for another video, but yeah, I think that Hyundai and Toyota really need to think about booting up satellite teams, because I reckon Baby's going to perform quite well. Now I mean that Hyundai, if they were to do a selection headache for just one, one team of three cars next season, they'd have the problem of also having to include the likes of Baby. Lube, and probably Nikolai Gryzhen as well, if he's performing quite well towards the end of the year. As well as considering the likes of Craig Breen, Danny Sordio, alongside Thierry Niven, or Tanak. Anyway, so some my thoughts, let me know yours in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.